Hello from one of the great venues in world football, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the commentary gantry, and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Real Madrid, and they face Metz. Well, the hosts certainly go into this game as strong favourites. They have better technical players and can be brilliant when everything clicks. But their opponents are well organised, resilient and pose a threat on the counter-attack. Therefore, an early goal will be the main priority for the home team. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Carvajal starts with Ferlon Mendy in the fullback positions. Vinicius Junior starts with Marco Asensio in the wide positions. And the main goal scoring threat provided today by Karim Benzema. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. And they're playing once more. Real Madrid with the lead here. And Foxing the defender, good defending in the end, and danger averted for now. Modric. Here's Carvajal. Karim Benzema. They do pass the ball with authority. Benzema. And Benzema! Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. Delivering it. And the danger cleared. Modric. And he takes it on. And saved by the keeper. Playing it in, and a body in the way. Force, Benzema! Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? And he's fired over the corner. Not really the ideal clearance. Well, nothing comes of it. And get. Well, he's given it away. Well, Real Madrid have certainly had all the possession over the last 15 minutes, creating lots of chances now. And you think if they do get another, it's going to be tough for the opposition to find a way back into this. Keeping it moving dynamically. Will he play it in? Well, the clearance half-hearted. Vinicius Junior. Not too fussy in clearing his lines.
Amadou. And they have possession again. He's going forward well here. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. Well, the referee not messing about. He's cautioned him. Well, it had to be a yellow card, and he knew it was coming. Time interval is fast approaching. Real Madrid leading. Stuart, your critique of that first half display? Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack, and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. Hits it a go! Well, closed down straight away. Pajot. Perfectly positioned to take it away. And the pass could do damage. He's just got to continue his run. Chance maybe. Able to close down the shot. And the stoppage time situation. One minute here. Space and time for the cross. And an effective clearance. And that is that half time here in the Spanish capital. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Vinicius Junior. Now with Benzema. Strong but fair tackle. Opa and get. And moving the ball nicely. Slipshod passing. Can they hit on the break? All hands on deck. Well, a fine first half performance by Casemiro. How would you assess what he's done, Stuart? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them oh, the lead. Oh, Stuart, an opportunity. And how about that for a save? Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Over it comes. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Casemiro. Look at Modric. No way through. Benzema. And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Well, he couldn't quite hit the target, Stuart. Well, it's a decent effort, but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper. going to make the change now the Preville it's with Pajot Oh, he's gone for goal. And not quite accurate enough, Stuart. Well, I think he should do better there. But at least they're now knocking at the door. <laughs> Substitution. 
possession for Real Madrid. Carvajal. And now Rodrigo. Benzema. Rodrigo. On to Benzema. Carvajal. And a throw in it's going to be. Jemerson. Cuyate. 20 minutes to go in this one. Oh, he's given it away. Casemiro. On to Benzema. Really inventive stuff from Real here. Tony Kroos. Hazard has it. Defensive efficiency personified. Didier Lamkelze. And here's De Preville now. his opponent completely and they've done it to square the game once again exhilarating well this is a very tidy finish as you can see he's under so much pressure but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly it's an excellent goal So back underway, one goal apiece here. Ten minutes left for play. Well, the atmosphere is so tense inside this stadium, but can they find that moment of magic to win this game? The crowd certainly thinks so. Just listen to them. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Only five minutes left for play and tension galore with the teams locked together. Played into the box. Ready to fire. He's blocked it. Wonderful tackle. Now can they counter clinically? Karim Benzema. On the offensive, is there to be late excitement? Benzema. Can he take advantage? Oh, they've done it! They forged ahead, and it might be the goal that gives them victory. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. away again it's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand so full time it is and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign yeah it's so vital to get off to a quick start in these group stages they'll be happy with the three points but now they have to back it up in the next game six points and you're halfway there well, Casemiro certainly did his job. Not that that should come as any great surprise. Interested to know what you made of his performance. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat. And he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display, though.